Now we're ready to rock our hips and glutes. Hip mobility is important in everything we do in life, including squatting and sports such as yoga. This move will leverage the rocker's stability to gain mobility in those hips. So we're gonna start with the rocker in a lockdown position, and then I'm gonna get my body up on top of the rocker. A lot of times I don't have enough stability to relax. Here I can, if I wanna use my hand or extend both legs to take load off, you can do that. Now I'm gonna rock my body, allowing the surface of the rocker to sink up into the tissues. I'm increasing the blood flow. I'm starting to get a little cross fiber massage, all which are great, great healthy things for our tissues. I'm gonna scan the tissue working from low to high. I'm allowed to do that because the rocker is stable. So I can really leverage my body in any way possible. Um, right here, I'm on a little bit of a sore spot. So what I'm gonna do is take an opportunity to further stretch my tissue and cross my leg. This requires a little bit of balance, but it's a really great way to get deeper, more focused acupressure. And we would consider this a progression. What also we could do is take our opposite leg. So here I'm gonna allow gravity to pull my body to the ground. I'm gonna cross my leg over. And this is gonna be a whole different area of the glute that's tough to get if something underneath you is moving around. So the stable surface of the rocker allows me to get into that tissue. And then I'm just gonna ride that out a little bit, giving myself a little cross fiber massage, allowing the rocker to do its work. So this is a great move to help open the hips, allow you to get into a deep spot position, and it's great for yoga as well. So this is rocking our hips and glutes.